ladies and gentlemen, friends, Americans, in your great history, you have pages that would allow you to understand Ukrainians, understand us now, when you need it right now, when we need you right now. Remember Pearl Harbor, terrible morning of December 7, 1941, when your sky was black from the planes attacking you. Just remember it. Remember September the 11th. Russia has turned the Ukrainian sky into a source of death for thousands of people. Is this a lot to ask for to create a no-fly zone, zone over Ukraine to save people? Is this too much to ask? Humanitarian no-fly zone. If this is too much to ask, we offer an alternative. You know what kind of defense systems we need, S-300 and other similar systems. You know how much depends on the battlefield, on the ability to use aircraft. When evil tries to turn your city, it is true, in the darkest time for our country, for the whole Europe, I call on you to do more. New packages of sanctions are needed constantly, every week, until the Russian military machine stops. I am addressing the President Biden. You are the leader of the nation, of your great nation. I wish you to be the leader of the world. Being the leader of the world means to be the leader of peace. Thank you. Slava Ukraini.